where it is. Okay, it's due tomorrow, but at least this leaves me tonight to work on. Huh? What is it? Someone filled in all the answers. They're all correct? Who would do this? Hmm. Clearly an Alvin Mathlete has chosen Craig to be his apprentice. He'll probably have to live in the woods now. Oh, I'm so jealous. You're gonna get to eat bark and take a bride who's a deer? Wait, wait, there's, there's something written on the back. What does it say? I can't read it. It's written all weird. Yeah, look at that writing. We got elves for sure, you guys. Let me see. Similar to Elvin, but no. This is cursive. I recognize it from my Bubby's birthday cards. I did your homework. Hope you don't mind. Pretty tough stuff. And it's signed, Helen. Helen? Well, that doesn't sound like a name for an elf. More like a stay-at-home nurse. Yes, it's old-fashioned. I like it! Well, it was really nice of Helen to do that. I should write her a thank you note. Hello, Helen. I'm Craig. Thank you so much for doing my homework. I'd like to give you a chocolate roll as thanks. Meet me here after school from Craig and his friends, Kelsey and JP. Ahem. <clears throat> and Morgan. Hey, Craig, thanks for reading out loud so we all felt included. OK, guys, let's meet back here first thing after school. Maybe we'll get to see Helen in person. I don't know. I guess I just felt like I found the rat. I should be allowed to touch it. Adults, am I right? Hey, Craig, where's Helen? I don't know. We must have just missed her. But she left another note. Give it here. <clears throat> Hello, Craig. I'm sorry. I must have missed you. I left my house as soon as my school lessons ended. Wait, she left her house? I would have come sooner, but my mom's a strict teacher. Her mom's the teacher? I've never heard of choco rolls, but if they're anything like chocolate, they would be forbidden for me to eat. Forbidden? I do appreciate the offer, though. Thank you for writing back, Helen. What? On earth is that girl talking about? None of that made any sense. The ancient handwriting, mom teachers, no choco rolls. Maybe we should just ask someone what's going on. I think the explanation is obvious. This Helen must live in another dimension! Another dimension? Yeah, I don't know about that. Yeah, I'm a little skeptical. Yeah, me too, and I believe everything. Allow me to explain. Normally, alternate dimensions exist apart from each other. Its inhabitants live in completely separate existences. But I believe that clearing has somehow become a gateway, a rift in time and space that's allowing your letters to travel back and forth and back and forth and back and forth between our dimension and hers. Oh, sweet Segan, someone's got her yapping about multiple dimensions again. 